but this is also we, Nintendo. Isn't we it? will get the verdict from Little C. Watch him back the. Uh, watch him back the game. So we've got the first match starting now. <laughs> we're gonna Two get heavies. we're gonna get VAR, but what we don't need VAR for is this live game. Z versus Waterman loses finals here at Cruise Control Five. Super heavyweights, heavyweights mean views here at Overdrive. Exactly. So yeah. I love to see it. Especially if it's for the final, but sadly mm. it won't be. Definitely, whoever whoever wins this game is in the money. Z versus Waterman is a a game I'm quite unfamiliar with. I don't know if they've played each other a lot. There's been tournaments no. where Waterman's been, where Z has well, and vice taken. and vice versa. Let's have a, a quick little look. Uh, they have played two sets, and it's one one. Last time they played was it's an overdrive. Waterman took it three one. The last time before that was last overdrive, uh, and Z won 3-0. So it's a very, it's a very close matchup, and it's looking at it so far. Yeah, we got about sure. one minute, one minute left on the VAR. We'll get that to you very soon. <laughs> and here we, I say here we go. We're a minute in. One stop down for both of them. It's a very even game, 11%. But again, that that Big DDD damage. that DDD super armor, Z Z acknowledging like DDD, he has he, he has so much super armor like side B, Not enough monkey for that. monkey punch. Where I say I think that's it. Yeah. I don't know. I don't play DK. <laughs> Here we go. I know this is very close to where oh, I was watching the game yeah. at this moment. Could we get our reporter Krell Deville to watch what <laughs> happened here? We got we got Krill Deville and Little C analyzing the game. I I I'll, I'll commentate this game, but when we get to that moment, I kind of also want to have a look because like seeing is believing. Yeah, of course. But will we see Z or Waterman going to lose fouls? The, I don't think if Gordo would have hit that, then Z would have took the game there. Damn it, oh. Waterman! No, it is it is Very gonna nice. make it. Oh, that. Spike. Yeah, uh, he's fishing for the back air. Hit him again. Just to hit here we go. Over. Here we go. We're, we're about to see. We're about to see the the, the replay. So so the, so it beams. What? Okay. Uh, what we'll do is, well, if we're towards the end of the game here. Obviously, last stock, last hit situation. We will get our reporters on the case for the mysterious smash grab. This is this is smash gate. Uh, yeah. I'm doubling and back air. Nice, nice. Z acknowledging. We're gonna quickly move over to our reporter, Creldeville. Creldeville, what happened in that game? So what happened was Z actually threw the sword, and it hit Little C, and then Z immediately grabbed Little C, almost instantly. Oh, so because of a high percentage, it looked like it was a smash attack, but. Oh, I see. I see. That makes sense. Okay, so so if, if people didn't hear that, uh, Killing Edge, the big red glowy sword thing, um, it it hit uh, hit Little C to then create not a, like a a big hit effect, but Z threw it and it immediately grabbed. So it wasn't a smash tag. So it's not a smash gate, and that is court adjourned. Yep. Let's get back to the game here. Z versus Waterman. He's got the early advantage from Definite, the start. Definitely, I think Z, Z obviously, I think Wat Waterman hasn't been playing Smash as much as they would like to, obviously, studying, yeah. studying for uni, but they got into their uni choice, so it's, fair play. Yeah, worked out fine. And dash attack, yep. Try, tried and true, DDD, edge guard. Yeah. Big, yeah. Fan of, big fan of doing it in doubles. I remember I did it about six times in one game when it was me <laughs> and Sharkman versus Benny and Temi. Well, we see Benny and Temi um, at, at Overdrive. It's, they haven't came to a cruise control just yet. I saw we saw uh, the pair of players at ooh reading the old smash, but Z dodging right away. We saw both players at Snow Overdrive. Temi winning amateur finals, Be yeah. just beating me out. That's when I started picking up Brawler. Just, just oh, the super armor. Not again. Yeah, no the super armor landing side B to take Z's first stock. But in terms of percentage, Z has pretty much a stock lead. Yeah. 
But again, DK, a lot of rage. Waterman knows the spacing, so. Yeah, of course. Very strong with the DK. Big hit. Down, down tilt, monkey punch, causing the trip. I think, yeah, Waterman was maybe fishing fishing for a down air, but decided not to. Ding dong! The Just witch the is not dead. I saw um, Waterman fought that again. That Ooh. side B super armor, it, Waterman's brought it back. He has, for sure. Mm. Again, Z has the stock lead, but there's a 112% difference. Definitely winnable for him still as oh. well. Oh, 100%. Especially with that. Side B not taking it just yet, but Giant Monkey Punch is ready. Back air. Back yeah. Air, yeah. That's definitely proven to kill. Oh, 100%. It's one of DK's best moves. Waterman and aficionado of hitting them. Yeah, hit some, sure. some ladder combos from time to time. The down B into the jab. Tacking on a little bit more percent. Maybe Z needs to. I think mean, Z is throwing, throwing, throwing out all sorts of moves, but DK is getting there first. Back. Yeah, got the advantage now. Mm. They, they do have center stage, but DK just can just run in. To be honest, dash attack. It's yeah. it's a long it's a long hit and move. Get Ball is in. Waterman's caught. Both guys off stage now. No hit. 110 to 104 here. Gordo, not going to take it just yet. Mando Gordo and the forward air. One, nice, one. nice. Z makes it 1-1. One, one. That was definitely anyone's round. It could go either way here. Ah, yeah. cruise control, 5. Obviously, um, I think, I, say, I keep saying obviously, it's one of my pet peeves. Waterman, I don't believe, has a cruise control under their um, under their belt at the no, minute. No, we don't think so. So let me let me let me let me do a little bit of double check and. I think he missed one or two, didn't he? As well. He he did he did, mainly mainly because of studying. Yeah. Yes. Oh oh, this is their second cruise control. Yeah. I, I didn't realize. Um, I thought they went to more than one. I also but, missed a couple because of that. Mm. Second in cruise control one. Could they be second, first, or maybe even third here at cruise control five? And I wonder how both these players will fare, if they can make it, of course, to Overdrive 12 at the Manx Telecom Hub. July 22nd, what a Big brilliant combo. 22nd stock from Waterman. My man is in the zone. Second, those headphones go on. Different man. Nice. Big hit. Nice, nice down B there. Taking Waterman's first stock. Well, he's about to die again. Yeah, that's the second stock. Apologies, I was just sending a message. I wasn't uh, fully, fully in the zone here. Bad commentator for me. That was a, that was an up smash. Didn't do a lot, and DK didn't really seem to move like at all. But again, if it's low percent. I'll see these characters, unless unless it's to confirm, you don't really want to hit smash attacks. Both characters have very long lingering lingering smash attacks. DD yeah. in particular. It's got yep. a big hammer, so. I'll get punished for that as well. Mm, definitely. Back end not coming out yet. <laughs> Spikes what, definitely what, work. Waterman well. with the header is going to be thrown off. DDD can obviously make it back with the, the plethora of jumps. Yeah. Could not work with some characters. Down. Oh. I think I think Waterman wanted to wanted to not go on the platform there. But these characters off stage now. This is insanely close. Go for it off. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Yeah. That's the two mm -hmm. one to Waterman. Waterman taking it and is one game away from moving to the grand finals. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Brand got a, a cheeky little rap. I believe it's chicken. I believe it's got some hot sauce in. He's taken a bite. Oh, a big bite right down the center. Two uh, one. It's 2 1 to you. They don't even know what the score is. Uh, hey, I mean, they, they, Warman's they're in played, the zone. Warman's played a lot of sets today. I think minimum five sets, yeah. and it could be potentially at one, two, three, four. 
yeah, four four sets today. Yeah. All best of five, so that is minimum. Three times four is twelve, uh, including this game. Fifteen games. That rap absolutely stinks. It has stunk up the playing <laughs> area, and I'm gonna ask Brent to move out the way so it doesn't stink. <laughs> yep. He's, he's not. He's not gonna listen. He's not. He's not listening. Ooh. Bit of an SD. Oh my god, that absolutely popped. <laughs> <laughs> he's off now. He, he, he's off. I, I, I had the courtesy to eat a bag of Monster Munch outside. <laughs> <laughs> oh, big monkey big punch. Hit. Big, 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 big monkey punch. And there hasn't really been a situation besides that game one where it hasn't been even. Yeah. Both, the, both the, like, there's been like, well, a lot of time, been at the same stock. Not really much of a considerable difference, but as, as, as I say that... Oh, well, I, as I said that, he had a 90% lead and DK hit two moves and then got half that percent. Trying to read the F smash, not coming out. And again, Waterman tried to punish off it, but Z with the forward tilt. It's a very fast forward tilt. Hitting the Gordo, but DD catching it. Big monkey punch again. 69% to 170 here. Nice up tilt, yeah. Taking Waterman down to his last stock. We could see a game five here, Lex. We might, yes. Would would be nice to see. Oh, definitely. These two these two meaty meaty gents in the living hell out of each other. Side B not punished as optimally as you would like. Waterman getting big hits in at the moment. Those up as Ding Dong's not gonna hit just yet. Z doesn't doesn't need tech. That's gonna be it though. Yeah, one one. Last last stock here. Waterman only at fifteen percent as well. Mm, definitely, it 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 can go either way. My God, big damage that shield. Yeah, that shield is the size of an M and M. But Waterman, Waterman, getting it back. Obviously, just hitting. It will recharge eventually, and I yeah. don't think it's going to be an issue anymore. Yeah, back, for sure. Back air in that uh, back air in that Gordo into into Z. Ooh, try to see a little combo go. Big monkey punch Ooh, rolling out the way. Just missed. Woman's thrown out a lot of smash attacks. Um, Hit him with his own spike. Definitely wants to just make sure the game's gone back air. Good spacing by Z. Good use of the Gordo as well. Dash attack very punishable if it doesn't hit. Woman not capitalizing on over. The suck is Z thinking, what shall I do? It's getting a little bit of a little bit of leg room. Good. In space on the forward till Gordo hitting. Big hit. Z Z won't want to go off Sejo now because of the uh, low percent. Just tack on, tack on the percents. Dash tack not gonna make it. Might try getting up there. Mm. So struggling to DK. This guy you don't want to struggle to land against Cargo Throw. Yep. That's and Waterman is gonna take it three one to have the run back against Hex Specs. But this is well, actually, I think. Fatigue could come into it. Waterman, Agreed, yeah. Waterman has played seven games in a row yeah. and is now going on to play another potential ten. Yeah. It's yeah, definitely going to be very tiring. All right. Again, I will go get Hex Specs for our grand finals here.